Hello. Welcome to the Gay SMR Apothecary. How can I help you? Oh, you have three prescriptions? Okay. Thank you. Okay, Chanel. Well, I can definitely help you with these, and in fact, you've come to the right place to get these filled. Have you ever been to the Gay SMR Apothecary before? No? Okay. Well, let me get a little bit of information from you for our records. Is that all right? Great. Let me just put those over here. All right, let me just get this set up here. Okay, can I please have your first name? your last name? Is that with an H? All right. Okay, and your mailing address? Do you have an email address where we can reach you? Go ahead. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I didn't know people still used Hotmail. That's so retro. All right. And do you have any allergies to any medications? No? Okay. Okay. And save. Okay. All right, thank you very much. We have your record all set up. Okay. Now, before I begin, would you like me to make you a nice relaxing vitamin drink that you can sip while I fill your prescriptions? Okay, let me make that right in here. And start with this wonderful water soluble vitamin concentrate. This is another concentrated vitamin formula that is um, more fat-soluble vitamins.
this is more concentrated vitamins, which has more minerals in it. And we want five milliliters of this. So I'm going to use this little syringe device. Okay. going to add something that's going to be nice and relaxing. This one right here. And now I just want to add a little bit of distilled water, which is right here under my disco ball. So let me just move this aside for now. Just pour a little bit of that in there. I'm just going to add these mineral salts. serve up and I'm going to serve it in this cute little glass for you. But before I do that, I'm going to add a little bit of bicarbonate, which will make it nice and fizzy and very pleasant to drink. Just add a little more water to that. So just sip on that. You don't have to drink the whole thing, but I recommend you do to get all those good vitamins. Okay. Cheers. The first prescription I'll fill for you is the Yassification Powder. This one is so great. 
you'll turn anything or anyone into something fabulous. And who doesn't need more fabulousness in the world today? This is a powder, so I will make it in this little vial for you. To keep things tidy, I'm going to put down this piece of paper. Fercetic Oxide. And this is going to add Slay Queen to this powder. Let me get the little funnel. Acetic oxide. Okay. This is period distillate, and this is going to add eight and left no crumbs. This is something they call Mariah Kerosate, and basically this adds Skinny Legend. Because if you want to be fabulous, you need to have a little bit of that Skinny Legend attitude. Next, I'm adding something called real nesethol, and this basically adds what I would say is called the house down, as in Versace boots, the house down.
this one is called On Pointium. This is always going to assure that your makeup is on fleek. And this is the final ingredient. This is called prosasamide. And what this is going to add is sass. I think I'll add a little bit more because we want a little extra sass for extra yas. And there you go, there's your yassification powder. And how you're gonna use that is, you just have to put a little half a teaspoon into any liquid, such as a protein shake, or you can put it in your oatmeal, or you can put it in a Cosmo. And it'll immediately turn anybody or anything into a fabulous yassified entity, okay? Just clean up my mess here. Oh, let me just add something to this liquid here. need to add a few more ingredients to this.
just let that sit here for a little bit. All right, and now I'm going to make the homophobe repellent for you. And this is something that is very useful for the month of June because it seems like Pride Month seems to bring them all out of the woodwork, doesn't it? Yes. So let me just get this going for you. This is going to be a liquid, so I'll make that in the speaker here. This is going to contain all the things that homophobes just cannot stand or detest. And the very first thing I'm going to add is fairy dust. The fairy dust is going to add magical powers. That's all we really know about it. We don't know specifically which magical powers, but we just know that they're very magical. So just add a little bit of that. And the next ingredient I'm going to add is right here. Yes, this is called unicornium. And what this is going to add to this formula is a heightened fabulousness. Because if there's anything that homophobes dislike the most, it's anything that's fabulous. So I'm going to add a little bit of that unicornium in here. Okay, now the next ingredient is a very important one. This is called dorothylene. And what this is going to do is it's going to give you the ability to attract accepting and supportive friends who will help guide you and protect you in your life. Sort of the way that the Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Cowardly Lion did for Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz. Okay, now the next step is very important because I have to activate the dorothylene using these little miniature ruby slippers. And I'm just going to tap the heels together three times. There's no place like home. Okay. Now, the next ingredient I'm going to add is called Chlorbegon. This is going to sachet all those haters away.
it's the month of June, so I'm going to add a little extra of this. It's necessary. This distilled water. Okay, just gonna shake that up. Oh, and how's your vitamin drink? Are you enjoying it? You're wonderful. You're feeling nice and relaxed, aren't you? Yes, I can tell. Now, there's one more ingredient. But I'm going to add that after I put it in this little spray bottle. This is something you're going to actually spray instead of um, put on your, or ingest. So I'm just going to use this little tiny funnel. Last ingredient is quite important as well. It's a little pearl, but these aren't just any pearls. These are pearls of wisdom. So I'm just going to take one of those out. You just need one, put it right in there. Wisdom is going to give you the wisdom to sashay away all of those haters and move on and not let any of those homophobes bother you because you know that you are fabulous and you are worthwhile and you have so much to offer to the world. Now the way you use this, it's very simple. You can see that little pearl is in there. And the pearl is not going to dissolve or anything. It's just going to remain in there, constantly exuding wisdom into this spray. Now how you're going to use this is you can simply spray it on yourself, sort of almost like an insect repellent, but this is going to repel homophobes. So you can just spray a little bit here. You can put it on your wrists like that. Or you can also dab it on your neck. Or you can put it anywhere on yourself. You don't need a lot. Now another way to use this homophobe repellent is you can just spray it around your room like an air freshener. And what it will do is it'll repel all of the homophobes that are in the room with you and not just the ones that come right up to you if you just spray it on yourself. And what I recommend you do is use a fabulous fan to help spread it all around the room more quickly, like this. See how that works? Oh, I can see all the homophobes running out of the room right now. 
it's working. So here's your homophobe repellent. Let me show you what it looks like. Isn't that fabulous? When the homophobes come into contact with this, they're going to go screaming for the hills. Just have to reapply my lip gloss. All right, now the next prescription I'm going to fill for you. Oh, it's the glitter balm. Now, this is something that is going to be in a gel form, and what the glitter balm is for is to cure gay malaise. That's when you're kind of feeling, you know, down in the dumps. You're feeling a little blue, a little blah, and you just don't feel like going out for brunch. And this is going to help just revive you and make you feel fabulous once again. Okay? Okay, this is a balm, so I'm going to make that in a little container. So we'll begin with the gel base. This is the carrier for all of the ingredients I'm going to put in this balm for you. I seem to have a little bit of some of the ingredients of the last remedy I made for you on my hands. It's all sparkly. Okay, and now the next ingredient is stardust. And that's it. What this is going to do is add glamour. Because when you're feeling a little down in the dumps, there's nothing that can revive you better than just a little bit of glamour. Am I right? Yeah. Just a little bit of that goes in there. This is a very special mineral. Keep right down here, this tiny little vial. What this is going to add is fabulaciousness. That's the only way to describe it. I can't really think of any better way to describe it than that. So just comes in this tiny little vial. It's very potent. So I'm just going to sprinkle in a little bit. Okay. Add a little bit more. There we go. Now, next 
next is this ingredient. This is glitteranium. This is just going to add a sparkle. Now the next ingredient is Essentia. And this is essentially essence of a fabulous champagne brunch. So we just need a few drops of that. And we just have one last ingredient, and this is such an important one for curing gay malaise, and this is called Rainbow Extract. And I was just adding some additional ingredients to this earlier before you came in, and can you see how that looks? It's got all the colors of the rainbow in there. And it's very dark because it's very concentrated. And what this does is it simply makes everything better. So I'm going to add a nice, let me stir that around. I'm just going to add a nice big spoonful of that. Let's add just a tiny bit more. Okay. It's very potent, so we don't have to add too much. There we go. Now I'm just going to stir this in here. Mix all those ingredients up. It's looking pretty fabulous. Okay. Now there's one last thing I have to do to complete this remedy, and that is to shine the light of a disco ball onto it to boost its potency. There we go. I can see that already. It's taking effect. Fantastic. 
Okay. Now it's ready. So let me just put the lid on here for you. And before I do that, let me just show you how this works, how to use this. And what you're going to do, let me just show you how it looks. You can see better with this light. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, just look at that. If that doesn't cure gay malaise, nothing will. Oh, you've been feeling a little bit of gay malaise today yourself? Oh, I'm so sorry. Would you like me to actually massage a little bit of that into your temples for you before you go? Okay, I'm happy to do that for you, absolutely. Okay. Let me just put on some gloves. First, I'm gonna put on these nice little white gloves. was not on correctly. There we go. of this on my fingers and then I'm going to just massage that in onto your temples, okay? Are you ready? on your skin. Just make sure it's nice and smooth on this side as well. Ready? Yeah, sometimes it works very quickly. I can see it starting to absorb into your skin. Just add a little tiny bit more. Okay. You can just close your eyes and relax. And just feel the cool gel.
Okay. So, how does that make you feel? Oh, really? You're feeling pretty revived already. That's great. It usually takes um, about 30 minutes, but it starts working fairly quickly, especially if it's been massaged into your skin like that. It goes into your skin much quicker that way. That's wonderful. Well, I can tell already that you're ready to go out for a champagne brunch soon. So it's definitely working. That's wonderful. Okay. Take these off. Okay, so I'm just going to put the lid on this for you. There you go. The glitter balm for your gay malaise. Is there anything else I can do for you today? No? All right. Let me just enter into your record the, um, the three prescriptions I just created for you so that we have that as a record next time you come in. All right. So we had the Yasification powder. And then we had the Homophobe Repellent. And that had Last but not least is the glitter. done. So here are the three remedies I just made for you. This is the Yassification Powder, the Homophobe Repellent. You're going to need this quite a bit this month. And the Glitter Balm to help cure gay malaise. Would you like me to package those up, or do you, you just put them in your purse? Okay. There you go. Thank you so much for coming into the Gay SMR Apothecary. I hope you have a wonderful day and a fabulous month. Well, thank you. Happy Pride to you as well. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.